Jake Gyllenhaal, a handsome 27-year-old Oscar-nominated actor. He once dated Kirsten Dunst. Right now, he's Reese Witherspoon's main man. The two met on his latest movie, Rendition, but 17 years ago, Jake was just a snot-nosed child actor. He helped me, like, to learn, this is my first movie, to learn about acting, really. Aw, Jake is 10 here. He just shot City Slickers, and the whole movie-making thing was just plain fun. But I hope I can do more movies like that. It was really, because, I mean, I like doing it. How cute. Ten years later, Hall was playing teens in Donnie Darko and Bubble Boy. He was still having fun and hoping to make some kind of impression. No group w walks away from this movie not offended. Or, you know, it's an equally offending movie, you know? Which for me personally, in terms of like depressurizing situations, is really important. After his teens, something happened. Jake turned 21. Now a man, he wanted to be taken seriously in Moonlight Mile. Every day you kind of, you sit back and watch and then you realize you have to play your part and then every once in a while you get kind of lost in it and then you get back in it and you kind of slap yourself in the face and just keep going. During his mid-twenties, Hall wanted to take chances. This straight guy proved his acting rage by playing a gay cowboy in Brokeback Mountain. On the red carpet, the former cute kid put the press in their place. The gay cowboy movie is not the appropriate title or explanation for it. Okay, Jake. He earned an Oscar nomination for Brokeback Mountain. And finally, continuing to stretch himself as an actor, Hall shaved most of his thick hair to play a Marine in Jarhead. Now, both the script and the director were concerned as to whether or not he would accept a role. Have a director who appreciates who you are, who's not like making you into something else that you're not, is really awesome. It's like probably unlike any, any experience that I will ever have again. So there you go. It takes a while to become a glamorous movie star. I hope I can do more movies like that. And there, look at this young lady. The Hollywood red carpet is a place like no other. Where else can you experience the collision of celebrity and near celebrity? Of journalist and paparazzi? Of fan and fanatic?